do. So this is the automated source sprinkling system. What it does is that it will tackle the problem of black ice which accumulates on the surface of the asphalt surface on the driveway. Mm -hmm. What it means is that during snowfall, the black ice layer accumulates on the driveway of the house. So to tackle that problem, what people do is that they right away sprinkle the salt on the driveway of the house. But for example, if a person is sleeping at the night, <laughs> he can't sprinkle the salt to get up on the bed. So what this automated system will do is it will take the snow fall and try to sprinkle the salt on the driveway of the house. Okay. So for the temperature uh, for the snowfall protection, we are using two temperature sensors. One is a temperature probe, and another is a water sensor. The reason we are using two sensors is because sometimes the temperature is of the environment is zero degrees Celsius, but there is no snowfall. So sometimes a lot of rain happening, but the temperature is around 10, 12 degrees Celsius. That's the reason we are using the two temperature sensors. Okay. So as soon as the satisfy equation of the snowfall, the sprinkler will start. We are using a DC motor over here. We sprinkle the salt on the driveway, okay. and to control the direction of the salt sprinkler, we are using a servo motor over here, okay. which will sprinkle the salt evenly on three different angles of zero, thirty, and sixty. Okay. For the demonstration purpose, I'm just gonna put some water over here, and that's our IoT dashboard over there. Okay. So this will, this is the status of all the sensors, which says what's happening on the whole salt sprinkling system. So for the demonstration purpose, we can see on the IoT dashboard, as soon as the water detection, I'm just gonna reset it to absent. So for some reason, the water detection still says present. So I'm just going to satisfy the equation of the temperature reading over here. So as soon as I put the temperature probe inside this bottle, you can see the real time value of temperature reading going down. As soon as it goes below 10 degrees, the system will start. <laughs> yeah. For that's the issue with the mechanical build of the system. The thing is that <laughs> when we put a lot of salt, <laughs> the salt container, the system gets clogged up. But the good thing about the system is that the whole system works. <laughs> <laughs> okay.